and we're live what is up everyone i thought i would do just a really quick live unlisted live because we're gonna put power in my storage so i can see at night for the horses and for myself but um i want to go more into this like why these diets are dead in the water and because now my consultations with people are getting like cartoonish because they're completely confused. Normally back in the day, people are like, okay, I need this, I need this, and I need this. Okay, let's do it. Now they're like, the, the, the confusion has gone beyond nuts. No pun. And coffee. It's gone beyond those three things that I used to always list. Now it's just gone wackadoodle. And uh, I want to show you right now, let's get to the point or else people get real bored in the first couple seconds. Uh, what is the problem? Okay, we're going to talk about the main thing that helped kill these two diets. First, we're start, going to start with why keto's dead. It's done. That's why. Look at that nonsense. Look at it. Look at that. Let's talk about some of these products that killed keto. And legit, people are still consuming this stuff. All right. Look at this. I mean, it's endless. And the magazines and the products and the cakes and the cookies and the collagen powder and the bone broth. All garbage. I mean, look at all the shite. I mean, look at that. Slim Fast got into this nonsense. I mean, it just goes, oh, Quest, Keto Quest junk, and Keto, what is this? Extra strength. <laughs> oh, my God. Advanced metabol metabolic support. People believe this nonsense. Hold on. Oh, jeez. Okay, so the problem is, is that like if we even do this macro breakdown, it's wrong, right? This is why keto died. You want guys want to see? Let me blow this up. Look at that. Beef jerky, which has sugar, eggs, and eh. salami. It should, it should be like on Sesame Street. Which picture is full of garbage that does not look like the other? Out of these drawings, the things that you could literally, you could make your own jerky that's not cured in sugar. because most jerky is and most built on you guys can figure out what that is salami same problem aged meats here's another thing people have histamine and then even on carnival they'll, they'll carnivore they will do salami or jerky and they're wondering wondering why their histamine isn't going away cucumbers why would you choose cucumbers out of all of this they're not in the cruciferous family. They're kind of low in fiber in comparison to a broccoli. So broccoli is going to have much of a lower carbohydrate count. So this is not like a whole cucumber. This is like a couple slices. Nuts have phytic acid. Most of y'all should know this already. Nuts have phytic acid. When you eat them, listen to me people, and this ain't even the grossest products. When you eat them, they're baby plants. And they like to rob minerals out of your body. So when you poop, because nuts are not digestible, they come out the back end, even chewed up. And this allows them and affords the, affords the nut to start growing from your booty in the ground if you go walk two miles and poop. Because nature doesn't understand that we have toilets and we live in the modern time. All it knows, all it knows, all it does know is to take out minerals because you're a predator chewing on it and it demineralizes people particularly iron okay cheese has casein the protein in it. it's very inflammatory to the gut wall and a lot of you guys are eating cheese this is a big reason why this diet died so people aren't getting better they feel better in the beginning all of a sudden their blood sugar starts spiking why is it spiking because you're eating something that's irritating the body and you don't even put two and two together 
and when the body's irritated, blood sugar spikes. Olives are okay if you don't have any sensitivities. Avocados are great if you don't have a latex allergy and allergy or an allergy to them because of the high amounts of potassium, fiber, and fat. Monounsaturated fat, dare I say. Okay, this is why these diet. Look at this. It's like noise. It, this hurts my eyes. All of this is keto products. Shall we try? Shall we try carnivore? Does that look any better? Let's go check it out. Chick, 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 check it out. Hi, guys. Because I'm going to talk to you before I go what these products actually do to your body, which is not keto adapt. Let's go to the carnivore world and see what we can find there. All right, here we go. Boom! Don't look much different. Do it. Okay. That's what we got. Carnivore Complete Protein Powder. You should probably use collagen, which a lot of you guys are having a reaction to the glutamate. And oxalates, I said it in the in Aztec vanilla garbage. The desiccated organ meats aren't bad for those who don't react to them. They are not as nutrient dense as just eating the liver. This is beef liver, liver itself, but they are they are an alternative if you don't have a histamine response. If you don't know, you have to experiment. And please put them in the freezer once you get them in the mail, please, people. All right, Carnivore Crunch is this. The beef recipe, more products. I mean, I get it. I get it. But if you're not eating real food and you're still looking for snacks, this ain't the way. Hardcore Carnivore, I guess these are spices. What the frack is this? Rub Shaker Multi. And they're calling things, car this is the reason why these diets die. Protein sticks. They're like, I guess, what is it? What do they call them? Pepperoni sticks or something like that, um, which they tend to put sugar in. Kind of a mass. But God, look at this. Embarrassing. Muscle meds, what, muscle meds carnivore mass chocolate fudge. How the frack is this carnivore if it's chocolate fudge? You freaking nutballs. Sagging, hanging ones of an 80 year old. You liars. This is why you fail on these freaking diets. Beef organs. Okay, that's, but I don't know. Look at the price. Okay, it's 39. Let's see what Ancestrals is. I think it's 38. I think they've dropped their prices. Getting a little competition here. Oh, God. More grass fed beef organs. What is it? Carnivore grain free chicken turkey and duck adult recipe dry rub for dogs this i don't have a problem with because it's for doggies beef jerky more beef jerky beef protein garbage beef protein with chocolate you can't make this stuff up carnivore beef chocolate stop i know it's collagen but still you're killing me um let's see here Hardcore Carnivore Tex-Mex Mega. The frack is this? Which is probably nothing meat in there at all. Tillamook Smoker Keto Friendly Zero Sugar Beef Jerky. More garbage. Okay, Carnivore Crisps. I mean, they're a great idea. Carnivore Crisps, they do all kinds. They do like ribeye and they do chicken skins and all this kind of stuff, which is great. But a lot of you guys who are trying to get rid of your histamine who are on carnivore, their histamine's not going away because y'all eating this stuff. Okay, and I need, I don't even hate on this product. I'm just hating on the amount of everything. It's just awful. This is the best thing I've seen here. Look at that. You got like a steak, ground beef, I don't know, maybe it's pork and then steak and then salmon and drumsticks and eggs, fish. I ain't hating on this one, ain't too bad. 
but that's a food list. <laughs> that is not a product. So here's maybe a dumb book. Carnivore diet with herbs. Carnivore diet with herbs and coffee. This is why this stuff is dying, people. Seriously. I can't with it. You guys want to know why you're failing? Look at this. Look at this idiot, whoever she is. I'm sorry, you're a freaking idiot. You got cheese there. The f what's wrong with you? But it's carnivore because it's an animal. And I know a lot of you guys have problems with casein, but I don't care because this book is going to make money. God, I'm so sanctimonious. Here, <laughs> carnivore products that are made out of plants. Love it. Fabulous. You know what? To be honest, this Aurelius, that's the best beef liver I've. It's crisps. I don't know what that dude is doing, but he is crushing the game. Okay. I had these, no histamine response, and just divine. So somebody's doing something right if there is going to be a product. But it's the multitude of all of them, especially when they're calling it carnivore and there's like cacao in it. Carnivore collagen. Again, glutamate, and his, uh, uh, which is histamine, latent, and oxalates. Carnivore complete. But it's got ancient cacao in it. I can't. It's just stop. This is why these products are making you go to H E double L. Look at all of this. Hey, you know what? These are great. Chicken feet are great for you guys. They're not. This is my pet carnivore. This is great for pets because it's got. It's got collagen in it without the oxalate it's dope it's so awesome because chickens don't eat they're not ruminants all right we good i want to talk about the products for a minute i'm, gonna, I'm surprised there's no like there's no like carnivore electrolytes there's got to be i know that there's got to be called carnivore electrolytes Like some of these things, pepper nutrition bar, what? Okay, they're not calling themselves carnivore. That's smart about these companies where they don't call themselves carnivore. I'm okay with it. More beef jerky. Carnivore bar sample pack. Some of those bars were like okay, but again, because they're made mostly of tallow and little pieces of like, beef in there. They use ground beef to make these carnivore bars, you guys. Hi, let me get, let's get back here. I'll do this. What's up, my people? Okay. Um, the problem, the reason why the, you're, you're dying on these diets is because people do like the electrolytes. Well, first of all, they'll do the, do the powder right and there's the preservatives in them and there's the additives and people having histamine response some of you guys are actually trying to do carnivore so you can literally fix that weak gut wall and when you start adding preservatives in these like powdered elixirs like the proteins it's a huge problem because they have to preserve it um also people are adding too much protein in and you guys are already having issues with trying to get protein waste products through the kidneys and a lot of you guys are dehydrated. Now, somebody asked in my Facebook course, because I have a, a keto course. It's on Facebook. It's going to be put on my website. So we're going to stop with Facebook very soon. But, um, and then you can sign up and actually be a part of it on the website. But a woman said, like, why is keto so good if you're saying that it destroys your electrolytes? And I'm like, well, that's because our soils have been depleted. So you can't get just easily readily magnesium in the plants like we used to as being uh, omnivores omnivores and omnivores types of animals sorry there's no such word omnivores all right i said it i make some mistakes sometimes when i'm talking i've got a million things going on in my mind like getting stuff fixed for the horses today <laughs> but uh 
yeah, our soils are depleted. And so if we were just walking around foraging, we'd get a lot more potassium in plants, a lot more magnesium, a lot more salt readily available. And um, yeah, we wouldn't have poison sea and, you know, we would get into salt rocks and minerals and animal meats and we would balance our shite. And we would have a strong gut wall, which would mean that we would be able to hold on to our minerals a lot more as a hunter-gatherer than we do today. And so there's a lot of confusion when you look at all these products. I mean, it seems like everybody knows buying these products. I don't see anything wrong with the products here and there when you guys are just using it as meal replacements or you're buying products that have horrible additives or, you know, chocolates and coffee and cheese and cheese crisps and all of this stuff and people's guts aren't healing they're still being exposed to high histamine foods through all these products even the desiccated you know meat in a capsule can be very histamine latent for those who are trying to heal their gut and all of us have gut issues so you have to be very careful how you do everything how you even if you're doing a diet you even if you're eating real food you still have to see Am I reacting to this? Because your blood sugar is going to be destabilized and too high if you're reacting to a food. You won't keto adapt. You know, sometimes people are doing better eat McDonald's than they do on these diets because the body has gotten so used to eating this garbage and it's killing you slowly. Whereas you instantly take out the bread off of a hamburger bun and you're instantly dehydrated and your minerals are just going somewhere. Um, because the bread makes you hold on to water. That's not a good thing. That's not what you're supposed to do to hold on to minerals. You're supposed to have a strong gut wall. You're supposed to be getting these minerals from Mother Earth. All right, guys, I just wanted to do a semi-quick video, which is not quick, why these diets are dying. Bad advice, bad food choices, products that are garbage, eating too much protein, eating too little fat, having people confuse you, say, like, you know, eat a lot of protein, don't eat fat, you won't lose weight. And fasting on top of carnivore is just like waiting for a thyroid disease, autoimmune disease to just happen. Just wait for it. And all these people who say they've been doing these diets forever and everything's so amazing, they're lying. Stephanieperson.com, because I'll tell you right now, people are like, what about you? Yeah, I didn't tell people that I was magnesium fracked for a long time. Because I just simply didn't know. But now we know. So there ain't no excuses. Because you got your girl right here. All right. Stephanieperson.com is where you can sign up for my course. It's $15 a month. You can also sign up for a consultation at stephanieperson.com. We're going to talk. Uh, you can also just get free content right here. Put stuff in the show notes below, what you want me to talk about, any questions that you have. I do see them. Sometimes I can't get to all of them because I just moved from California to Texas, hated it, from Texas to, to Tennessee, picked up two more equine horses and bought raw land where there's no house and no power, no electricity, no anything. I also rescued all my horses. So if you guys want to donate to helping get up more fencing and better shelter for these animals go to stephanieperson.com and hit the donate button you think that's it yeah and we're out energy 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 at almost 55 15 years solid on keto without any cheating no refeeding and i want to see what i need to do to stay balanced yeah you can't mess with those electrolytes you don't play with the electrolytes you don't play with a couple of other things doing these low carb diets, keto and carnivore, and that's why they're gonna die. Yes, and then we can start over again and do it the right way. Peace.